imagine we want to make a survey of answers to this question. You're going to take a sample from your school or college. There are five years and you're going to take a sample from each year. Let's suppose there are 500 people. This is too many, so you're going to take a sample of 50. Let's assume there are 100 in each year. Then you could take 10 in each year as your sample. But supposing the numbers in each year vary, you would have to allow for over-representation and under-representation. You would need to stratify the samples. So for year one, we take eight individuals and not ten. Doing this for all the years, we get the table as shown. The problem is we have 10.5 and 9.5 people to ask. If these are rounded up, we get 51 people and not 50 as wanted. If we change the sample size to 55, the sample sizes of each year are as shown in the table. But these still add up to 57.1 and not 55. If they are rounded in a normal way, the total becomes 57. What we could do is take the two values which were over 0.5 but by the smallest amount and round those down. As a result, we get a total sample size of 55, as required, and each yearly sample is a whole number.